right, well, I am gonna play one more session tonight because I am a scared coward baby. I don't have my ice heart here with me. You know, Nova never had to play this alone. He always had a big, strong ice heart there with him. So why am I playing this alone? You know, I start emailing. You know, I don't want to go there. I don't want to go left. Yeah, that's too quiet. This place doesn't have chambers. Ooh, is this the phone? Yeah, it's actually the future. This is not coming to the future. We're going to have a new entity. Must be removed. Matters are suppressed. We're going to have a new building called City Office of Mankind. This is not even I'm not going there. Okay. This is bad. This is very bad. Oh, lots of booze in church and candles and crap. Oh, nope. See, I'm finding good stuff. I'm finding. I'm playing by myself. Find your eyes, girl. Is giving gratitude. Oh yeah, you're up. You're a swell guy, Mandis. Can I touch something? Did I have a touchy icon? You know what? I actually remember this. I don't know. I don't know where this goes, but I remember something about a candle. I am gonna get this like lost in the wall. Sorry for the slow frame rate, guys. I'm just gonna go right the hell up there. Oh man, did that did that just turn and look at me? Did it? I remember watching and seeing that. I am not putting that in there yet because I have not explored. I remember that. Oh, see, I am not touching any of that crap. I'm not touching any crap. Did it just get red? Seriously, is there any hidden stuff? Doesn't look like there's any hidden stuff. Door. Oh, I'm hidden stuff. Ah, yes. I came in that door. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, is that like a heavy bear? I know what I'm doing. Oh. oh, bring back the organ music. No, oh, okay, 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 okay. okay. there you go. Well, I tried. I don't think there's anything else in these pews. Although it was cool that I found the teddy bear because that shows that my children have been here. I wonder what's over here. Happiness? Probably. Jesus, the music completely changes. Oh, that's right. That's right. No, I'm going to Creepy music again? Okay. You know, I never really took a close look at the mural up there. But that, that in the center, that does not look like a person. Doesn't that look like a, is that supposed to be a pig person? A pig person standing over the dead pig, carrying a heart? And you got the machines? Oh man. That is, that is so messed up. They, they were worshipping the machine. They were worshipping all this crazy crap, Mondas. That is so weird. That is so weird, Mondas. Uh, should I have a handle? Uh, okay, I'm gonna die. No. Then, oh, you want to look at this first. And then I get a hint. There you go. Some kind of mechanism, a secret infernal window. No, this can't explain the answer, but why? This can't happen. Why is there a machine in place of And where are they people? Why are there drag marks about this altar as if someone was pulled away? Uh, is the is the blood not a clue? You're really not good at putting two and two together. You're really not good at doing that. You're all going to say something else. Hmm, it looks like there's tracks here and things move. Well, 
let the doom begin. All right. And seriously, right? Yeah, I put that there. There we go. Oh, did you just here? Oh, 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 oh. So much. We gotta do this. So crazy. Okay. The teddy bear's floating! <laughs> oh, I had no idea that would happen. I had no idea that would happen. <laughs> if I knew anything about Jesus and the Bible and Matthews and Bedlam, whatever the hell that is, this a hellish portal thing might be scary, but I am blissfully ignorant. Oh, I did not know that was going to happen. Can I grab it? I can. Oh, did you see that? I could totally grab it. <laughs> I think I'm going to a very bad place now. <laughs> yep, it closed behind me. It totally did. That seems like a good place to leave you, Teddy. Yep. Be afraid. Be afraid. Oh, I'm hearing bugs flying around the ground. Listen, Papa. Hold the egg to your ear. You can hear the sea. Thus, from an, from an egg, from a baby, from a potato. I don't do I'm not trying to procrastinate or anything. I'm just. <sighs> They're beneath me. See, I was too big a coward about those lights earlier. Although, now is a good time to be afraid. Where am I going? I'm listening to the guy. Does he just keep going? Oh! There you go. There's Susie Q. There's Susie Q. And I'm gonna play again when I have Ice Heart. Because he is my big strong man. And I love him. And he loves me. And he won't let Susie Q get me. So, until next time. Bye bye. Hello, this is April from Dreadplay, and I am back here again, where not too long ago I just saw Susie Q run in front of me, because I'm playing Amnesia, Machine for Pigs. Last time I said, there's no way, no way, it's quiet, no way that I am playing without my ice heart. However, due to constraints, I must play without ice heart. And now is when things are really going to become terrifying. Because it just got quiet, I'm standing here, I'm sure the game is thinking about how I'm not progressing, and it's thinking of ways to kill me. Either that or the audio track ran out or something, just to freaking terrify me. Where's the hallway? There's a hallway that Suzy Q ran in front of. Yeah, down there. I'm going to die. I am. I'm... I'm going to die. I was a big baby. And I stood around. Oh, now why did, could I open that? There are so many things you can't touch in this game. But that's something that I can open? Just... Just... This game just doesn't care. This game doesn't give two flying fucks. This game is so cruel. 
It forces you to look around everywhere, but there's nothing good to find. Nothing good will ever be found. Wait, and apparently there is a way to lean around corners. I'm playing with a gamepad and I don't know how to do that. So I am not gonna be leaning around corners. I'm... Do I turn off my light? I'm sorry if it's too dark, guys. I'm sorry if it's too dark. I don't see anything. I don't see anything. Is there actually something here? Oh, I saw you. <gasps> oh, it's really close. Do you see me? Oh, okay. You saw me. You saw me. So... I died. It was so dark for me. I don't think it's going to be as dark for you in the recording. But... That was really dark for me, so I couldn't actually see anything. Am I still alive? It put me in the cage. So I'm not dead? That's weird. Soda break! Ah. So, here, I'm just gonna try and peek around there. So is that it? The game's just like, yeah, you're a noob. So, we thought... Oh, you don't like the light, do ya? Come on! Am I supposed to do this? No? I'm not supposed to do that? What am I supposed to do, game? What am I supposed to do? Can I hide? What am I supposed to do? I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I guess I'm just supposed to avoid it. Oh, here's a door. Oh! That was a loading zone? And so to the stoking. The fog will not lift. The ship is becalmed. Everyone lies in the half-light, waiting to drown in the dry air. He is the paperweight that ballasts them. That wasn't scary. I don't know if I'm supposed to be scared by that. Like, once the- there was a total lack of background noises shortly after I started up this playthrough. If there was still background noises, that might have still been scary, but for some reason there was no background noises. I know I delayed a little bit before going down the stairs because I was being a big baby, but not really. Not that much. I couldn't possibly have delayed myself Oh, it opens this way. I couldn't have possibly delayed myself as long as Nova did. Is that a door? Have I been here before? I think I have. I probably... Does that even look like a door when it's closed? Oh wow, that like really is invisible. See, they had like that secret passage that was a painting way earlier, and that was totally visible. You could totally see that that was a secret passage. And then you have bricks and the mortar, and that takes a lot more time to construct. A lot more time for things to go wrong constructing. I wonder if that would have been open from the beginning and I could have gone down there and run into Susie Q and poked her in the butt or something. Yeah, meat processing. Well, what am I supposed to water do? In his shoes. Always the water and the sparks of the embers of the wheels. It's too bony. It's too damn bony. What's too bony? Water at the wheels? What is this game talking about? Oh, no. okay. So, did I just come up here to get a hint 
to tell me to go back down? I mean, am I supposed to go down here? Have I touched that Zuzaphone? No, this is new? I think this is showing that the smoke towers of the factories are those three buildings along the very top, and then the two buildings slightly underneath there. That's like a sewing factory and something else that's kind of connected to these top three. And then the real crap is under here. Kind of like an iceberg. The tip is nothing. So down, I find new things. What is this? Piston rooms? Okay, I love this. Good, like, no. Piston rooms! And pistons are machines. <laughs> If I find Susie this time, will I die? Where are you? See, I don't believe you're blinking lies anymore. You can only lie to me so much, game. Pistons. Like... Oh, hey! I saw you. See, scares like that don't work when you don't have ambient noises that are already scaring me. I'm not scared. I am playing alone and I am not scared. You're gonna have to do more than that. Are these pistons? These look like big belts on big wheels. I don't know what a piston is. This area seems really well lit though. That's good. That also makes it not scary. The fact that it has these turn of the 20th century that didn't exist yet. Aw, oh, crap. It's those stupid indoor lights that are always in big buildings and stuff. Blinky, 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 blinky. Be scared, be scared. I will not be scared. There's been too much blinky. You've been, you've been blinking me all game, game. I don't care anymore. And I'm looking at everything, desperately trying to find something that I can touch with my hand. Oh. Am I gonna get something? Ooh, piston, I see it, way over there. Oh. Hey there. Because if you notice, I can fur finally touch something. If I could touch more things in this game, that wouldn't have been such a hint. I'm just going around. I saw Susie. I thought I was gonna die, but this game told me no. No, you're not gonna die yet. Free. Wait, did I anything? Just turn that window pointlessly? That's pointless. Alright, since there's all these room numbers. This is one. Is this is this whole thing one? Oh, okay, that's two. God, I'm so genius. Okay. So now I got one and two still. Alright, I'm getting this. Because I watched something that's happened before that doesn't necessarily mean I know what's going on. In this way, the more product is processed, the more power becomes available to the machine, and productivity is actually increased. A simple stroke of genius, but one that encapsulates the benefit of a self-regulatory automation. Ah, so you want a machine that runs itself, because that could never, ever go bad in any way. Let's create a machine that is not dependent on humans. What could go wrong? Ooh, it's not yours. It's a force going. Not cool, I need to though. Five's going. What's that? Danger, no entry to the distance. The machinery is at rest. At rest. There goes six. How many pieces do I need? Two? Is two enough?
two is enough. No entry to the pistons when machinery is at rest. Well, let's call this time here. I just got engine number six fired up. See you next time. Drink the blood of Christ and eat his flesh. Uh oh. Susie's found you. Ah! Fuck it. Run, run. Ah! Ah! Oh! Oh!